this. In my opinion. Ryan, you are not the head of the school just yet. So until that time comes, I need you to go to class and attend your tutoring sessions. I am not discussing budgetary issues with you. Oh, and leave Marcus and Aaron alone, please. I am tired of them coming into my office. This is simple, yet confusing. I do not appreciate these accusations that you're making against my administration. Now, as I see it, there's nothing more that I can do for you. So please leave. I'm very busy. I know Aaron is responsible for this. I just can't prove it yet. Or maybe this isn't so black and white. So that's my life. And you know the way that I get them to go away is I drink. Because you know, some people when they drink, they start to see things that aren't there but me. I actually stop seeing the ghosts. And I'll let you know a little secret. I'm about half drunk right now, so. <laughs> okay, first of all, I get that we are probably gonna disagree about our findings. And you know what? That's probably gonna be what drives the show. Yeah, so. But if you ever try to humiliate me in front of the crew again, I will slice off your nuts, I will chop them into a fine pate, and I will feed them to you on a cracker. What's a pate? I'm about four months away from running out of money completely and losing everything I have worked so hard to get. So excuse the fuck out of me if right now I am not jumping at the chance to use my gift. <laughs> okay, very funny you two, now go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Mr. President. Which proves that it's never too late to reinvent yourself and become known as the city that's too busy to hate. For National Geographic, I'm Kelly Cody Grimm. Thanks for watching. Why, why would I, why would I want to be a nun? Why would I want to be a sister? That is crazy talk. But sometimes life takes you in different directions. Oh, okay. <laughs> Madonna.